folks have to get the fits ready because football season is here. It's here. And they will be out. And sneakers are very important. You know, Jackson right. State games, we look at folks' shoes a lot. So <laughs> what do you look for in a good sneaker? So, of course, comfort uh, and style. So I sell mainly New Balance, uh, Pumas, Reebok, Saucony. Some people say Saucony. Uh, but style and comfort as well. So those are probably the main two things. So do you think it's too colorful these days or you like the color waves that would come No, nah, I'm with the colors. I'm with the colors. I'm a neutral person myself, but I still like some color. So, and then colors are very popular. So sometimes a lot, a lot of colors equal a shoe that's by sales better. So I'm down with the colors. Awesome. And then when you think about just looking at the wall, you have, you have so many nice options. What do people need to know about? Like what's, what's considered in style? What's swaggy these days? What's swaggy these days? So the most popular shoe on the market these days is going to be New Balance. Uh, the, mainly the 1906 and the 9060s. Those are the two most popular styles uh, on the streets these days. Gotcha. And when you think about why you decided to even open up this boutique in the first place, what was really the, the draw? Well, I've always been like entrepreneur spirit, uh, even like back in school days from selling t-shirts and all type of things. So, and I went to work at Foot Locker uh, for about three years, part-time. I had a full-time job. I would get off and go to Foot Locker part-time. I did that for like three years because I knew I wanted to open a shoe store. So I went to work for Foot Locker, try to learn as much as I could, and then I started to do my own. All right. So how about we do something a little different then? Okay, what's up? I'm going to put together some outfits, All right. and you're going to put together some outfits. All right. And let's see what we come up with and what looks the most swaggy. Okay. I, I keep wanting to use swaggy, even though swaggy is not cool. Okay. That's, that's cool. That's <laughs> right. cool. I'm with it. So should we call it the concrete fit challenge? I'm down with that. That's not like a plan to me. Yeah, so of course, come out and see me. We're at 2943 Old Canton Road in Fondren. I have a website, concretekicks.com. It's spelled a little different. It's C O N K R E T E K I C K Z.com. And even though you said back in the day you knew you wanted to have a shoe store, do you feel like you really fulfilled your dream and you're doing it the way you wanted to do it? Uh, a little bit, but not really, because I got so much more I want to do and accomplish. So. Uh, getting the store open was one step. Uh, next month will be 10 years, so that'll be another step. But there's still other steps I want to take that I haven't reached yet, so we're going to keep going. <laughs>